Hi everyone, this is Ms. Chapman. I'm going to give a short presentation on the life and mathematical contributions of Leonard Euler. Euler was born April 15, 1707 in Basel, Switzerland and passed away September 18, 1783. He is known as a Swiss mathematician and physicist. He studied at University of Basel, earned a master's in philosophy at age 16. He began working at St. Petersburg Academy of Sciences in 1726. He served three years in the Russian army as a medical lieutenant. Euler married Catherine Bell in 1734 and during their marriage they had 13 children but sadly only three survived. In 1755 Euler wrote one paper per week which totals to 52 papers. He has over 800 publications and those dates span 136 years. In 1777 a memoir was published. In 1862 a book was published that contained all of his unpublished work and on the right is a copy of a book that is one of his most famous works. He is such an, an exceptional man in the mathematical world, and we are so thankful for him. He began naming functions f of x. He developed e, which is also known as Euler's number. He popularized the symbol, symbol excuse me, pi, which is shown here on the right. And he is most known for his mathematical contributions in number theory, complex analysis, and calculus. In number theory, he is most known for his Euler totient function, which determines the number of relatively prime integers less than n. For example, the phi of 3 equals 2, because 1 and 2 are both less than 3 and relatively prime with 3. There's a few properties that go along with this function. For example, phi of p, where p is prime, is always equal to p minus 1, and for m and n relatively prime, the phi of their product is also equal to the phi of m times the phi of n. Moving on. In complex analysis, he introduced i, where i equals negative 1. Euler's formula was also developed and Euler's identity. These are very important in complex analysis. Now here on the right we see a graph where our a takes the place of our x number line or our real numbers and our y-axis is replaced by imaginary numbers and instead of labeling our points x and y we label them a plus b i. In calculus, he is known for his infinite series for sine x and cosine x, and he also determined that E is irrational. I'm going to take us to our little Storify containing all of our fun facts about Euler. We can just scroll through this. Just some fun facts that just summarize the life of Euler. Just whatever I found that was most important and that we should all remember about Euler. Going back to the presentation here. Next we have the quiz that goes along with this presentation. Please take it. It will be graded. It's just a few short questions and you should be able to answer them if you've been listening. And remember, this is a video, so you can go back, pause, play at any time. Here is a list of all of my sources written out nicely using EasyBib. And that's it. Thank you so much.